Yo, what's up guys, Mike Red Fox. In this video, we're gonna test this RTX 3080 12 gigabyte, which now has a 90% LHR unlock. So the news today is that the 3050 and the 3080 12 gigabyte now have a 90% LHR unlock. And these are known in the space as like the version three LHR cards. If you think back, version one is like the first attempt with the 3060. And then we had the traditional LHR cards and then which are now fully unlocked. And then we had the version threes, which are the 3080 12 gigabyte and 3050, which remain unlocked until today. So now we get up to 90% unlock on both those GPUs. So in the test bench, I have the 3080 12 gigabyte. We're going to be testing that out in this video. Uh, and we're also, what I'm curious to do is test out the power draw. We're going to do that measured in line over PCIe with the Elmore Labs PMD. Because if you remember for all the previous iterations of LHR Unlock, um, they were doing some really crazy power spikes. I've tested that out in previous videos. I want to see if that's true now with this 90%. So let's get into it right now. We'll get started. So I'm over on HiveOS website. This is the change log. And what came out today is NB minor version 41.4. Uh, which has an LHR unlocker for 3080, 12 gigabyte, and 3050, has the expected hash rates there, which is around 90% of what those GPUs should be able to get. So you can get this update through HiveOS right now, it's available, um, or you can get it through the MV Miner Discord, which I'll be leave linked down in the description below. It's available for both Linux and Windows. Now, I tested this card a little while ago, and you can see the Ethereum hash rate I was getting with it at the time it's around 64 mega hash for 200 watts. By the way, I'll leave a link to that video up in the card because I test out a few other cryptocurrencies uh, for this 3080 12 gigabyte. So I've had this up in mining for a little bit. So we're going to jump into HiveOS and we're going to check it out. And we're going to look at what power this thing is pulling at, well, inline over PCIe. So let's switch over now. 109.5 mega hash reported in HiveOS. You can see on your screen right there. The other thing you're probably noticing is it's saying 268 watts in the software, which is not accurate if you're paying attention to the meter that I have above me on the screen. And you probably just saw it's jumping around quite a bit, right? As low as 220 watts, then we get up to like 310 watts. And that's pretty much what I've been seeing. It stays a little more steady at the higher wattage, whereas the previous iterations of LHR unlock stayed more steady at the low and then spiked high. Though this does seem to be bouncing around quite a bit right now. So just take that into account if you have these cards and you're building a rig of them. Just want to be really safe considering the wads reported in the software may not be accurate to what this is actually doing at the wall or inline over PCIe. And what I would expect if this GPU and hopefully when this GPU gets fully 100% unlocked is that it would probably stay around that 310, 320 mark for its wattage pull for the amount of mega hash that it's getting. So Switching over to the miner again, NB miner version 41.4. You can see that hash rate reported here right now, 110 mega hash and the power a little more accurate for the high power spikes we're getting around 315 watts. So that's it guys, that is the 3080 12 gigabyte. So if you think about the theoretical performance this should be able to get, should be able to do 120 mega hash for around 320 watts, which puts it exactly on par with the 3080 Ti and the 3090, which is gonna be awesome. So I hope we get there soon, but I'll leave links to everything I talked about down in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, hit the like button if you did, sub to the channel for more GPU mining content. Join my Discord if you wanna chat, the link's down in the description. Social media links are also down in the description. And as always, please take care of yourself and each other, and I'll see you in the next video.